is a uh, this is a brand new Pat Musi motor. It came into a customer. Uh, it had serious problems. We took it apart. We fixed a bunch of stuff, put it back together, and uh, it was so lean it was ridiculous. But anyway, uh, it's going in a nicer car. We just did a couple poles. It's 1100 horsepower. I don't think I got enough timing on it. That was the two uh, poles after I did all the valves and I gave it a little bit of fuel and uh, did 1100 horsepower. Rigged out on the money at 6800. So I don't see how it made 1000 or 1150 horsepower with 92 jets and a 632 with 18 degree uh, elder brock heads, but that's what he said it made. It didn't run the number, not even close. It was a second off the ET. Anyway, I'll give you a little look real quick. What we did do is put a uh, little belt drive on for him. We put a good set of pistons in it because the pistons in it were, uh, they were not the right pistons. They weren't even 18 degree pistons. They were some, I don't know what the hell they were, but they had a, uh, they had a uh, valve relief for an exhaust on an 18 degree piston. Doesn't add up in my book. My 18 degree uh, quick 16 or quick 8 pistons don't have that. It's got a Moroso pan, not a big deal. It's the uh, 21097, I think. But it's got the Elderbrock Victor heads, as you can see. 18 degree, fully CNC ported. This old girl's going to make probably 1125 when I'm done. But I can assure you it doesn't make 1150 horsepower. And I don't care whose dyno it is, bring it to mind, I'll show them. Anyway, uh, Mike, that was her. See ya.